you guys, this is my drive tour. We finally got a, I don't know why I didn't get a phone mount to begin with. I guess I didn't think it through. I thought I had to get an actual GoPro or something, but, or I thought it was my, maybe illegal to have one. I thought in California you couldn't have one on your dashboard. So I looked it up and it said it was fine. So it should be fine. Anywho, we are in Henderson right now. I'm actually driving off Maryland Parkway and I'm about to make a left on Parkway. And it's six in the morning. I thought I'd tell you like the day and time too so you can know the traffic situation. So today's a Monday and it is 6 a.m. 6 13 a.m. I guess. So the sun's coming out right now. It is September 12th, 2023 as well. So uh, I know the sun comes out at different times depending on the time zone and the time of year. So there you go. Alright, so I also think when I'm at a red light, especially just now, it took forever to turn green. There's no reason why I need to record sitting there at the red light. So I'm going to cut out the pause of me sitting at a red light. <laughs> so in case you're wondering like, wow, those are quick lights, they were not. Um, so I have it on widescreen so you can see my dash. I was trying to not cover the dash. Gas right now is at 465 on the old Chevron, by the way, in case you're wondering. Um, I wanted to not have my dashboard in the video, but I kind of want to do widescreen so you can see on either side of the road as well. So hope that's not a bother. Comment down below if it is. And as you see, construction cones. So one thing I noticed about Nevada is um, there's always construction cones on the road. And I never always see people working on the road. So I have no idea why they always put cones down. So that's kind of annoying and it's very consistent. <laughs> Someone had said that the construction cone is the actual Nevada state flower. And I thought that was pretty damn funny and true. So anywho, yeah, see here. Oh no, wait, now this Chevron is 449 for the cheapest. So, okay. Um, something plays some gaming food drinks called The Keg. I haven't yet to go there yet. I'm really curious about that. We have a Best Western Plus over here on the right. I think these are our apartments or condos called the Doom, or Doom on the left. So now I'm off uh, passing Jeffries. Still on Rose Parkway. I'm heading to the 215. So, anyway. So to my right, you have the Canes, and we also had that. I think it's Big B's Barbecue that I vlog and Tommy's Burgers that I vlog right over here. That Bourbon Street on the left. There's some other places over here I haven't checked out, but didn't have a good experience at the old Bourbon Street, but I only went one time and I was vlogging it. That's the time I, I had more um, courage to, oh, I'm passing Eastern Avenue, by the way, to vlog um, casinos and some people, they get all weird about it. I didn't know, like... I said, I want you vlogging people gaming, so I get it, I guess, if people don't want to be on there sitting, I don't know what it is. Speed limit's 55, by the way, on Rose Parkway. But, um, the guy was kind of a jerk. And they don't, like, provide, like, the drink-wise, like, you get one complimentary drink when you start, and then, like, they, they regulate how much you're playing for what you get, so obviously I didn't get another drink. But my friend was plain enough to get another drink, but she didn't get one either. So I, the guy was just a rude. But the it was cute in there, and it was I liked the decor, but I don't even think we won either. So it was like, oh. <laughs> okay, now it shows speed limited 45. Um, to the right, scrambled. I also vlogged that. Non and curry have not, but I'm sure it's going to be good. Indian grub. Oh yes. Burger fly. No, I haven't vlogged that. Timbers. Nope. And this lovely cement truck is spitting out asphalt at me, so I'm going to not get so close to it. Alright, I don't want to get too close to this thing. We have the Green Valley Ranch Emergency over here on the right, and um, to my left we have the we have a whole bunch of different things over here, buildings. We have Redemption Fitness, I'm seeing Mackay Island Grill, and I did that one. And that Steak and Shake, I think it's called. Did that one. Some lashes, nail place. Oh, Peaches Tacos, did that. Yeah, there it is. Right next to Steak and Shake. And 
to the right is the Paseo Verde is what I'm passing. You can take a right and that will take you to Green Valley Ranch Casino. Some of the places right here like have a really nice view of the strip um, because we're kind of on a hill as you can see so straight ahead. I know you probably can't see it off this video but at night you can see it all lit up. Like I can see the Strat Resorts World and the Sphere and everything. And try to pass this dude up. Alright, so here's the 215 Henderson. 215 East. And I'm gonna exit Valley Verde. So I'm heading over to Green Valley. I don't know the Henderson area I was at just now. I'm not sure what area of Henderson that's what district or whatever you call it. But um I noticed they have like Centennial Hills and Anthem and Seven Hills and all this stuff and uh, that was nine of them so I don't know what that one was but I'm going towards Green Valley. And sometimes like the sun is so brutal I don't know if I can do a vlog tour or vlog tour uh, yeah drive tour vlog tour um, in the mid-afternoon because I don't know how like the reflection of the sun and everything if you would even be able to see. So here at Green Valley Ranch is to the right here. You would exit Green Valley Parkway or you can go the back way like I said on Paseo Verde. The district as well is right over here. Evangelical, Evangelical Lutheran, and the next one is Green Valley Presbyterian Church. So if you're Lutheran or Presbyterian, you got your churches right next to each other. And right after that is going to be Greenspun Middle School. And then to the left is our homes. And as you see ahead of me, once the light turns green for us, uh, the strip is straight ahead. Beautiful view, especially at night.
there's ways around like driving like you needed to get to the 215 to avoid the street if it's during school time because it can get pretty hectic with uh, kids crossing the street <clears throat> there's a crosswalk and there's cars picking up the kids it's kind of a pain um, that I found is taking a Royal Grand to Wigwam just that one street I just passed before the school and then you can take that to the freeway this is a four-way stop this is Windmill and Valley Verde so the village of Silver Springs is showing and then this is the Pittman Wash that we're going over right now nice trail to ride your bike or walk I did it I went geocaching on it one time to the rights of celebrities because that's celebrity homes not actual celebrity homes but the, the name of them um, yeah all just neighborhoods right now we're approaching a church to the right they um, actually had a really cool live nativity set that I checked out last year it's called Green Valley something I forgot what it was called yeah there was a Baptist church um, it was really cool it was in this parking lot right here and I've never seen a live nativity set and they actually had a big camel like over here too I was like damn that's neat all right and here is a train track we are approaching and uh, that's about it guys so that ends my drive tour hope you guys liked it don't forget to like share and subscribe bye everybody